Welcome to the 2010 National Science Bowl Solar Car Challenge. We're here at the Bethesda Chevy Chase High School tennis courts getting ready for competition. Our students are inside preparing right now, but in a few minutes, they'll be out here giving it their best. My name is Thomas Escaro and I'm on Buffalo Prep Team Middle School and we're from Buffalo, New York. We're here for the, uh, the Nationals and Science Bowl. We competed in the Rochester, um, we competed in Nobuche Rochester um, Regional. We got first place in that one, so we were excited. Today is a solar car challenge and it's a nice day out, it's humid, you know there could be a little bit more sun but we got to work with what we got. Really excited, I think we're going to do extremely well and I'm ready to see what the day brings. Well the practice rounds are over, now it's time for business. All the cars have been inspected inside at the gym, all the teams have had a chance to come out, test their cars out on the practice track, and now we're going to have the regular competition. When this is over, in just a couple hours, we'll have our winner. On your marks, get set. Let's cheer for him. Let's hear it. We can make noise. It doesn't stop him. Let's go. Let's hear it. Oh, right. oh catch that car. <laughs> catch your reflection. Okay. Hello, my name is Thomas, and I am on the Buffalo Prep Middle School team. My name is Monica, and I'm on the Buffalo Prep Middle School team. My name is Julia, and I'm on the Buffalo Prep Middle School team. My name is Pam, and I'm on the Buffalo Prep Middle School team. My name is Veronica and I'm on Buffalo Prep Middle School team. Take your mark. Get set. Go, go. go. Well, when we were racing at the end of the race, the motor popped off. So that's, that's I guess, a very important part of the car besides the solar panel. So we sort of need that. We're trying to lose you think that's our problem? Well, why do we need it for the problem? Why don't we just like buy it? We got safety glasses on, please. The actual hey guys, if, uh, if you don't need the whole team in here, Pamela Acker. I'm the coach of Buffalo Prep team, middle school team. This is our first year here at the Nationals and I'm just grateful for the opportunity to be here today. It's been truly very great and fun and amusing every day. And I am Crystal Austin Seymour and I am the co-coach of the Buffalo Prep middle school team. 
and like my colleague here, I'm having a great time meeting people from all over the country on a beautiful, beautiful day. They have loved meeting the people they've met. The competitions for them, all we kept hearing was awesome. The judges were very knowledgeable and really took time to make the young people feel welcome for first timers. And once they were selected, they got to work. They really got to work. And what I like about what the, my colleague did, we got so much involvement from everybody at Buffalo Prep. Yes. Reading questions, getting everybody ready, uh, parents got involved. It was great. Solo car racing was fun. Um, we let the kids do their own design and we wanted it to be their project. So we just went out of a whim there and let them do their own sketch of drawn pencil and paper. They started there and then they just created their own design and they went to work to put things together. And then we just looked at it and said, do you agree with this? Explain it. and. That's basically how we're here. We had no formal training or anything. No. We just went on a whim here and just crossed our fingers and hoped it worked. And what was nice about what they did with the solar car is that, you know, sometimes one person likes to be the person who's in charge and say what to do. This was a group that got together. They mapped out, they said, look, we're all strong personalities. We've got to be a team. Yes. We've got to work together. We've got to try and make. And I think having the opportunity to be in a competition in solar cars allows them. We have them talking about college, where they'd like to go. You know, RIT, MIT, Cornell, Johns Hopkins. I mean, when you're in eighth grade, who thinks about college? You think about what it's going to be like to meet some people maybe think about high school, but they're thinking about college, what these opportunities will give them. Having They met physicists, they yes. met people who work for the Department of Energy and what they do. Staying they in met the dorm lawyers, was a huge thing. Staying, staying in the dorm the area. Dorm, I mean, on an the airplane. exposure has been tremendous for yes. our kids. I'm well pleased and, and grateful for the opportunity and plan on coming back again. <laughs> BPGP, are you with me? <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.